my initial thought was this is not for me. Uh, I'm someone who's very terrified of public speaking and it's very far outside of my comfort zone. My initial reaction was no, I'm not going to do this, this isn't for me. And um, But I was intrigued by it having watched other TED Talks um, via YouTube. I've always loved TED Talks and I've always wanted to try to do one. I'd heard about Chris, Christina's TED Talk class and thought, wow, I would love to be a part of something like that. So when there was an opportunity for the adults in the building to do something similar, I jumped at the chance to do it. TED Talks are so inspirational, and if there was something that I could say that could be inspirational, or even to find some inspiration for myself, I knew I wanted to take advantage of the opportunity. When you start the Building Voices journey, you don't know where you're going to end up. So you can't go into it already knowing what the outcome's going to be. You have to go into it with an open heart and open mind and think that you might have a story living within you that you didn't know was there. Oh, I think I went in like most of the participants thinking that I really didn't have any good ideas to share. But through the app and really through talking with my colleagues, I think we kind of sorted out the ideas. They had some great icebreaker um, activities we did on the first day and that really got me thinking. Right away we sat together and we did exercises where we were really, it was really asking us questions about our, ourselves and really tapping into this very vulnerable place in ourselves where we don't really share a lot about, about with strangers because we all in this group didn't know each other right away. The community that you build so fast with everyone else participating is incredible. They give amazing ideas and Christina as a mentor is like literally unbelievable. During the process of the master class, you unlock videos as you go. And once we completed, I believe the first four, a variety of style videos unlocked. And that was the real key for me. When I came in to do my practice, I had pretty much memorized it. I had worked really hard on writing it. I felt pretty confident about it. And then I realized like there's so many things I was doing that I was not aware of and just the public speaking part of it. And I got such great feedback from Christina and Karen that that helped me tremendously. Once I went out there though and looking at people and seeing that people were really hearing what I was saying and people really just looking at their expressions and eye contact that I was was really connecting with them, it was really powerful. I was so afraid of messing up um, and I know that when I got out there as soon as I started speaking I just remembered like why I was doing it. And even after the experience I think um, getting emails and getting feedback from people on how that they used the words that I said and applied it to things that were going on in their own life was incredibly powerful. The most important thing that I took away was that I could push myself so far outside my comfort zone and still be okay. Because a reminder that we all come from such a different place and that you have something worthy to share to everyone else and give to others. Everyone has a very unique perspective based on their own life experiences and sharing them can really help make the world a better place.